welcome back guys. Today I'm going to be continuing my conquest with Greece. And just kind of recap what we did last time. We expanded into the first couple of sites. Uh, we found that none of the AI players are very close to us. We've got Rome is the closest and who we're going after first. They're off to our east. Got Babylon down to the south. And Egypt up to the northwest. Yeah. So let's see what we can get done today. event in Syracuse. Syracuse anyway. Uh, we could definitely use a court merchant. But becoming gracious would also be real useful. The we're gonna want to not go with being gracious because we're gonna piss off two of our families are greedy. The Argid and the Lucid both have greedy leaders. Grab the court merchant. Seven discipline. Very nice. There we go, buying more stone. You do with a hamlet, but I don't think it would be a good one. I guess because of the Odeon there, I get the bonus from that. Need more stone. Outside the territory. There, build a quarry. <laughs> I'm 
We have to send a unit over to hold this city site. Once these guys are healed, I'll send them back over here. our way over to Babylon. Throw the young side. Okay. <laughs> Becomes spoiled, becomes humble, or becomes proud. Humble, obviously. Dead. Didn't me? I got outplayed here. Spawned another unit. Probably could kill that one too, but I'm just gonna fall back for now. So I can use this guy to hold this site and send my uh, hero out to kill them. Problem is, it would have spawned it there. I don't need to give Babylon a free resource. That's a nice city site sitting next to. Oh, the Babylonian queen has died. My wife is now debauched. Lovely. Be able to heal him on that spot next turn. Ah, I can add a go here.
Ingenuity. Interesting. You're going to need stone cutters. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. That's not what I meant to do. Sold some of my stone. <laughs> Quarry? Cost two orders because I gotta clear the wood. turn. Out of the vein, about us. I'll take the money. Hell yeah. All the quarry. Ooh, I can build it. The theater? Interesting. Hmm. Requires 90 stone. <laughs> At least we're finally starting to make a good amount per turn. just no reason to build quarries down here. Do farmland instead. Eight, nine, you can even get ten farm here. Some stone to work with.
Oh, my wife is now head of the Seleucid family. Interesting. off room yeah it's Avalon now likes me room like it doesn't I'm okay with that see if a city is connected with the capital. Okay, so this is the city screen. And so all of them are connected except for Croton. Whoa. Hmm. My son and heir is now head of the this family. More confident than ever in the face of danger, come gains courage. That's a good choice. Permanently. All cities get plus six board. So that's huge for expansion. 
This gives me plus 800, but the problem is I'm already at 900, and I get over 120 a turn. So really, I'm losing out on like six turns of training, but I'm already almost maxed. But I can't even really use that that quickly. So we're to build a bunch of more military units just for it. Now this would be good because I do need constitution as an ambition. I'm gonna go to the border growth though. Ah, that's right, I can upgrade my men now, too. It's to go for forestry next though if I get it. Uh draw. Yeah like a little tiny island? Like what is this? Outside the court, you discover your daughter being dragged down the street in chains. What the hell? Jeez, humble gay bastard. My discipline's not high enough to give her wisdom. So she either loses discipline or she, she loses uh, charisma. I'm gonna have to lose the discipline.
I need to go with the orator. My son and princess have given birth. Wait, what? <laughs> Granddaughter, third in line. Word of our knowledge of military drill has traveled far. An emissary representing Rome arrives at court, humbly requesting that we share with Rome what we know. I'm not going to show military drill with Rome, who I'm planning on fighting next. Oh, thanks. Get the Harrison. finish at the same time here. Okay, ten turns to make a settler here. think that's a good idea. Just make a settler from here and be done in four turns. Start making roads between my cities. stuck on this little tiny island are you kidding me that's where they spawned <laughs> uh, it's so painful to see and they didn't have the tech to explore on the water so that's why their scouts still sitting here they even have another settler sitting on this tile look at that sucks for them. <laughs> Oof. Oof. Didn't know that was possible. King has fallen ill. Governor Mar the Merchant has died in office. No! Exotic, divine, or spoiled. Ah, oh, thank god. It's worried there. Alright, we need a new governor here. Mm -hmm. 
clearly my new daughter. Daughter has to be up. Interesting. Are there two different ones? One for the Odeon, one for the Here. Interesting. to here. So you see these two move on their own, right? On automatic. That's on automatic scouting. Seven orders left. They should move on their own. That's a lot of choices. We needed the wood cutting. Or the other one. How did we lose both of the car the ones that we wanted? Let's do this one since it's only three years. and they'll be dead. Wow. Look how much my border spread with that, too. Pearls, elephants. Over here, it was like, we heard you like water. or some water. <laughs> This one probably saw the most dramatic expansion like this, how uh, it spread way out over here. Plus one level for new units, plus two civics per year per connected, per connected, all cities. <laughs> That'd be worth. Where my scouts go? This one didn't move at all. 
And this one didn't move at all. So how is automated worker or automated scout supposed to work? Like what automates them? Seems like it's not work. Possibly. Oh wait, no, they have spread. That little island too. <laughs> oh, that's that's unfortunate. We don't even have camps researched yet. <sighs> I only have one citizen. Five specialists. That's crazy. I feel so bad for killing them. Brother has proven his good sense and insight gained wisdom. Grandson's old enough to be. Uh, we could really use a scientist in the family. <laughs> Saying. Here go sitting. Uh, sitting here. Get an Axeman and plus one Charisma. Plus two Legitimacy and plus two Citizens and four Border Tiles in Croton. Where such leadership should not be wasted. Fortier. I'm going for this. Two Citizens and four Tile? It's huge. Next turn, we'll send him home. I don't get these scouts. Oh, this one moved a little bit, I think. Right? Wasn't that over here before? Ah, oh, Rome, you're too funny. That's so sad for them. <laughs> they got stuck on an island as a starting point. Babylon got this whole landmass down here. It's all basically. They've already, they just formed a city right next to my freaking... Territory. Why they chose there and not this city site's beyond me. So we might have to fight Babylon before Rome. All I know is we're going to secure these two spots and then start preparing an army. Picking out Rome should hold. Take it. Isn't centralizing? No, I need constitution. Darn.
Hmm. I don't really care what the tribes think about me, so let's get the bonus to four in opinion. I thought that was supposed to make it go up. Oh, it did. Okay. It made it go up a lot. Some of them. Ah, uh, we can't go there. Still built for you. Get that settler. I still can't believe this. This is ridiculous. That ship there for now. <laughs> Their units are all melee units, too. I can see more. Courtmaster's dead. Wife's ill. Oof. Okay. Why do you really be like this game? I want spearmen. <laughs> I want all these things. Uh. Let's get the constitution. I'll at least make my uh, guy in charge happy. Then you'll need another settler. That's not what I was trying to do. Whatever. I'll just have him take up the road once he's done building there. Because he was got he got in the way with his construction. Still not moving. Scout is moving. Trip's just gonna chill there. Hmm. 
Ooh. One to anchor line. It's a transport ship then? Anchor. Naval units can anchor to allow land units to move through water tiles within the naval unit's anchor range. Anchoring takes a full turn to complete. The land units cannot move through tiles until the turn of anch after anchoring. Huh. So that gives me an anchor range like that. It says land units can move through it. So if I line up a couple of ships here, could I then move land units across to them? Hmm. Interesting. Oh, my wife's dead. Mutual benefit. Messenger from Babylon, an intriguing offer. A strong military, but a shortage of resources. Perhaps we can benefit from the situation. She'll give me archers. If I give her wood. I don't have that much wood. Those archers would be nice. This archer unit. Ah, here we go. ambition. And I'm losing my entire court. Down to one courtier. Eight, I'd have to enact four more laws. Oof. Have that little bit of gold. Easy. get the honey oh I can't yet I need land consolidation first
So if I move this unit... I could move it one. Anchor it. Suggest to me the range that it could move land units across there. That's the case. I only need one more, I think. to quarry. Inspiring. It's good. Intelligent. Considering sending this settler over to this one, so I have the other settler coming up already. forestry afterwards we're blowing through wood song is so haunting Scouts are moving a little bit. This guy's going way out. Corner. Judaism founded in Croton? How'd they end up founding? No, oh, I must have built a shrine. No, I didn't. So how'd I end up founding Judaism? Huh. I don't know. Not quite sure how that works. not build roads outside your territory? Certainly can. What's the deal with here? Because of the 
Is there some tile? Tile you can't build a road on? This doesn't make sense. I got a state religion. Cost me a lot of my civics production. Queen is dead. This can reach Judaism. Elected by night, constant vomiting and diarrhea. I have severely ill. Stepmother has died. Uh, already got you for science. Uh, so let's go with charisma. Yeah, I'm just gonna send this guy forward to the next city site. This one come right behind him. All right, and with that sound, that means that we are done with today's episode. We didn't do too much uh, in this one. We secured these two other city sites that we're about to settle. And we've discovered Rome is stuck on a small <laughs> island at the moment. Um, I have to imagine they eventually would break out of this once they got their research done. They're currently trapped, so I'm going to take advantage of that and try and kill them. Check out this whole anchoring sea mechanic soon. Interested in this. What this does exactly. The whole ink thing. Naval units can anchor to allow units to move through water tiles within the naval units anchor range. It takes a turn. So this suggests that I can move land units within this circle. Um. If that's the case, I think I only need one more and I would be able to cross, or it might take two more because this has the bonus anchored range. I might have to upgrade this one a couple times to be able to do it. But then we could just pull a full army across the, the water and take out, wipe out Rome real quick. We're going to have to prepare some more army for that. We are building a stronghold, so we should be able to build a hoplite soon, which would be huge. We could use hoplites to go at them. Been some more growth in that city. But yeah, so we'll pick this up next time. Thank you for anybody who's watched. And uh, if you were looking for that previous episode, I'm pretty sure I mentioned it at the beginning, but if not, first ones which I live streamed is down in the description. So be sure to check it out. 
and I will see you guys next time.